Hello everyone, welcome back to Farmer's Dynasty. I know you expect a live stream today. Uh, I've decided to pre-record my episode and go stream on Twitch instead. So if you're watching this, uh, you can expect a Twitch stream here in just a couple of hours uh, over at DoSomeS.tv or find me on Twitch at twitch.tv slash DoSomeS, either one. Uh, I am headed to sell some grain as the price has gone up to eh, almost eh, about 850 USD per per ton. I think it is. Uh, let's let's double check real quick. Yeah, 864 USD per ton. Very nice. Um, I, I kept thinking I needed to keep doing more side jobs to make money, but I keep forgetting that I have all this grain sitting here, and I've been waiting on a better price. I skipped a couple weeks. All my crops in the greenhouse are ready to go, so we're going to be doing a lot of picking up. And not only that, but our crops are a little bit closer to harvest at this point, so. Hopefully we can uh, we can make some cash here. No cars coming. No cars coming. Good deal. Uh, without having to do all this extra plowing and stuff, I can sell the grain I've already got. Uh, get a little bit better price out of it than I was going to get. Not quite the price I wanted, but we've got a lot of it to sell, so. It's going to take me quite a few trips. Uh, but in this episode, we are going to be selling grain, getting some money together, and hopefully we make enough to go buy a tractor. I don't think we will, but uh, we're going to be getting closer to that anyway. Uh, so, I'm going to run some grain back and forth, and uh, I'll be back with you once we get uh, to our last trailer load. And then we will go check out the greenhouse, get it harvested, and uh, bake some more stuff that we haven't been able to bake before because we didn't have the ingredients to do so. I think I've got everything planted that I need for it, so hopefully that is what is going to happen and maybe to even do uh, some outhouse deliveries today uh, as well. I don't, I don't know what I'll have in store for you to be honest with you, but I will bring you back when I get to my last load. Well, we just unloaded the last load and we're up to... Uh, 94,834 USDs. We're going to head over here. I want to look see how much this tractor is. I know we get a better deal if we wait until July 15th through the 20th, but uh, I want this tractor. <laughs> I want this tractor pretty bad. Uh, I didn't realize just how slow the old Jack Bear was until I was sitting here, not live streaming this for the first time in a while, just doing a recording on it, and uh, really understanding uh how long it takes to go back and forth five times to the grain mill so uh i know we didn't quite make the money we should have because we sold the canola early but without the uh starting canola on the field or the starting grain on the field uh that was really the only money that i had to start with so uh that was my first grain being sold oh look crops are starting to grow on fields guys look at this there's wheat. Wheat growing on the field. How much is this field? Field is $24,000. $24,000? Oh, dang, that's a lot. Okay, never mind. We'll, we'll forget about that field for a little while. I want to see how much this old uh, Fent tractor is right here. Pretty sure that's what this is. It's even got the little silver thing on the front of it. How much are you? 91200 And we have 94000 God, this tractor was 80000 not long ago. How much is the, the lender? 108000 Dang it all. All right, let's hop down to... Let's see. There's one down here. Yeah, let's hop down to this bus stop here. Uh, I, I just want to see. I want to see how, how much some tractors are. Because I'm buying a tractor. <laughs> it's it's happening. Uh, I we, we need a new one. I can't do this anymore. I love the old Jack Bear, but my God, is it slow. <laughs> Not only that, we need to start prepping to buy the bigger plow anyway, so uh, let's go see here. 140, yeah, God almighty. All right, where's the other one? The other one's over here on this side. Good gracious, 144,000. Maybe, maybe I waited too long. Maybe that's the problem. I waited too long to buy. All right, this one right here, I do believe. Please be a better tractor that's cheaper. Oh, this is the bigger fent. This might actually be a bigger... Yeah, that's the bigger fent. 98,400. Gosh dang, man. It's so... It's so... Man, it's just inviting me to buy it, too. 91,000 for the other one. I really want this one. 
Um, I guess what we could do... I'm not selling the Jack Bear. I want to keep it to, to put it up in the city and fast travel to it. Or maybe, yeah, may, maybe up, yeah, up in the city's fine. Uh, I just don't want to sell the Jack Bear. Oh, dang, that's a lot. 98,000. I wonder what we could get for, uh, if we go make some, I, I know we need to save our, our stuff to sell in September, but I'm trying to get some money right now. I'm trying to make enough money right now to buy at least the tractor. Uh, it's faster. It goes 36 kilometers an hour. This only goes 23. That's, 23 is pretty dang slow. That's about, uh, what, 15 miles an hour? Something like that. Yeah, I think the only tractor up at the up at the one up north, the the store up north, is the uh, Linder 94. I think that's the only one up there. I'm not buying it. That's, that's too small. It's not much bigger than the Jack Bear. It ain't worth buying. So my goal is to get at least 98,000. I only need um, 5,000 more. So I don't know if we can get 5,000 from selling crops or selling cooked meals to John, but we're going to try. Alrighty, back at the house. Let's go uh, let's wash the old Jack Bear up here. Again, I, I don't plan on getting rid of the Jack Bear. I just, uh, I, I like the Jack Bear and all. It's been a good tractor to us. But at the same time, I need something faster. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster. Uh, this is just not working anymore. Alright, let's pick all this up. And uh, see if we can't go make some full meals. I'm hoping that is the case. So I didn't know this originally, but if you just hold down uh, the L button, I mean the E button, uh, you can just pick them up. You can just scroll right down through here, pick them up. All right, now um, I need to go see what all we need to make again before we plant anything. Uh, I think if I just plant a mixture again, probably be okay. Actually, let's uh, let's do that. Let's uh, let's go zucchini on the far side here. There we go. Seedling storage, zucchinis. We'll just go down the we'll go down the list and then we'll start over after we run out of table. So we'll do each table one for sure. We got melons right now. So let's swap, go to bell pepper. And then cucumber. And then chilies. Probably do two tables of chilies. And then we'll do some more. Uh, pumpkins. I guess because of the spicy pumpkin soup. And then we'll do some more tomatoes because delivering tomatoes. That's always a big thing. So we got to make sure we've got tomatoes and uh, pumpkins on hand as we plant these. All right, replanted. Uh, I figured just going down the list, it gives us a bit of each. Why am I losing money? Oh, the water. Dang, the water takes a lot of money, doesn't it? Holy crapper. Alright, let's go get all the stuff we have down here. We got not a whole lot of fish. We got a lot of mushrooms. Uh, we got a lot of apples as well. So let's go ahead and get all the apples. Move, move. Uh, milk, yep. Okay. Uh, mushrooms, yes. Fish, yes. Uh, that's duck eggs. Can't do anything with those. Honey, we'll take all of those though. Uh, I'll take all the regular eggs. We got 569 of those. Holy crappers. Uh, pumpkins. We'll take all those and then we'll take these as well. I'm going to leave the rest of those tomatoes just to have on hand. Uh, let's go do some cooking. Oh God, I was about to say, Becky, if you're in the kitchen, I'm going to lose my mind. All right, now, um, egg casserole a la forest. We can do 114 of those, but I don't know how much they sell for. So let's be let's be reasonable about this. We'll just do a test. We're gonna make one of each, and we'll go see what the profit what the profit margin is on these. So red egg casserole, and then we'll take a note of which one sells for the most over at John's house, uh, and then we'll do the same when fall rolls around. But right now, I want to try to get uh, all these. I just I just made one of those right. Oh, I'm just about full. Okay, so I got to be careful here. Uh, egg casserole, Oreo. Okay, let's let's see. Do I need do I need the same ingredients down here? No, these take different ingredients than these do. The only thing that takes the same ingredient is chilies, and then that's it. Uh, and milk. 
milk, milk and eggs are in pretty much everything. And then honey, of course, in the honey base, fish, the fish base. Uh, but eggs, milk, and then chilies on these two. And then bell peppers here and here. Tomatoes here and here. Yeah, so very few things. Let's go see on these which, which sell for the most. Hey, John. Good to see you. Yeah, yeah. Let's cut cut all the small Care talk, buddy. Trade? Cut all the sure. small talk. I need to what I need, need to see what you what your what your prices are here. All right, that sells for twenty eight, thirty six, and thirty. Uh, I've got ten of these. I can go ahead and sell. That's four hundred and eighty. Oh, that's a piece. Okay, so 28, 31, 30. So we need to make red egg casserole sells for the most right now. There's four hundred and eighty. There's three hundred seven. All right, then we can sell all these. I need to make red egg casserole. There we go. Okay, so confirmed red egg casserole is the way to go uh, out of those, but I want to try to use my milk and eggs as reasonably as possible. I don't want to try to make the most expensive thing right now. So red egg is winning at the moment. Also, we're up to 95,696 already. So that's good. That's a good start. Let's run back to the hut. We need to eat. We do need to eat. Holy crap. Okay. There we go. All right, red egg casserole is selling for the most at the moment. Let's make a sushi. I haven't made these because I haven't had chilies to make them. So now I have chilies and I can make some of these extra ones. Um, I've made all of the uh, honey stuff, but I'm going to make them again. Rafter soup. So we got sushi, we got rafter soup. And then we have bakery fish special we've made, but I want to test the prices over at John's, like I said. So red egg casserole is winning at 31 and some change at the moment. Uh, and then let's make a honey ice cream. We'll go sell it at John's. I just want to see what these sell for. Don't don't be mad at me. I'm, I'm trying to figure this out, honestly. Um, I can't make any more of those because I don't have any more fish. So, uh, What did I just make? Hang on. So right now I have a sushi, raptor soup. That's all the fish dishes. Bakery fish special. And then I've got a honey ice cream. So I need to make the other two honeys. And then we'll go honey apple pie. Okay. And then we'll go back to John's and we'll test this out again. And honey pancakes. So I hope we do. Uh, I hope something else brings a little bit more money. Although we do have a lot of chilies. I hope it's not the fish stuff that's the most expensive. If it is, we'll have to choose from the stuff that we have more of. Because I don't plan on doing a whole bunch of fishing right this second. Although I do plan on getting plenty of that in while we're waiting on the fields to finish up. I don't want to skip to too many weeks. I, I just you? wanted to get kind of ahead of the ahead of the curve here. Sure. So. Uh, Alright, so this sells for 34 36 35 so the rafter soup right now is selling for the most 38 43 43 so 43 20 for either one of those uh so out of the egg dishes which are the ones we can make the uh red egg soup is the most the honey pancakes or honey apple pie is selling for the most as well uh other than that it's going to be the rafter soup is going to sell for the most so um looks like rafter soup and honey apple pie or honey pancakes either one whichever one we have the most stuff to make i've got 10 more honey recipes so we'll turn all those into one thing uh and if i have to i'll go catch some fish um for the for the next one but uh, i want to make as much as we can of everything that we have to make right now so red egg soup it is for the eggs it seems like and the chilies and then uh we'll see how much milk that takes and if we have to combine nope up here uh this takes zero milk okay so red egg casseroles i can make 151 uh it takes tomatoes and bell peppers and eggs and then honey apple pie takes apples milk and honey so i can make all 10 of those um yeah let's let's uh i don't use all my bell peppers though because the rafter soup sells for the most how many bell peppers do i have hang on that's that's a good question. I have 163 bell peppers. I've only got 114 chilies though, so I'm having to kind of try to balance this out because I'm not going to catch 150 fish. Uh, 15 fish is about all I'm going to catch. So yeah, that that that'll be fine. Let's do that. This may be a mistake, and I know what you guys are thinking. You know, don't do it. Too late. <laughs> Too late. Honey apple pie. We're going to make all ten of those. That just takes apples and milk, and I've got plenty of those, and I can get more of that. So that's that's a pretty quick easy fix for that. And then I have enough uh, cucumber right now and mushrooms to make 113 egg casserole, egg casserole a la forest. Now, we can go make some serious cash, I do believe. 
Uh, I know we're not getting great prices out of this. It's probably like 60 or 80 or something during the fall. I don't. I haven't done the meta on it because I didn't have enough materials to make all this stuff, but I'm going to this time around. Just like I planted the greenhouse just now, I'm going to do that until, um, until I have enough to make plenty of stuff. Also, we're going to do way more fishing because the rafter, rafter soup you? is the most expensive at $46, and that's just here at John's. Care to try? Sure. So, um, yeah. Also, we need to make more spicy pumpkin soup. All right, so this is going to sell for $4,783 for 151 red egg casserole. That's selling for $31.68. Uh, this is going to sell for $432, not bad, uh, $43.20 a piece, so I got 10 of those. Uh, and then 113 of these at $28.80 is at $3,254. All right, let's go make some spicy pumpkin soup. How much are you getting for these? $10, $9.50 for those, uh, $4.80 something for that, $0.72 cents for those, $0.48 cents for the eggs. Yeah, so not getting a great price. Uh, just the chilies by themselves are fine, but I want to uh, I want to make sure I'm using this stuff correctly. And actually making meals out of this you know what i mean yeah you know what i mean uh, i want to make meals out of this stuff i don't want to just kind of you know not not do it i guess i want to make sure i'm getting the right the right price out of all this kind of stuff so nope trying to go to bed again all right let's make some more spicy pumpkin soup uh let's make 90 more i think the most i've had to ask is nine so Let's make 90 spicy pumpkin soup. That'll leave me a few pumpkins left over in case. Like, I don't, I don't know in case for what, but in case the wife needs them, I guess. In case Becky wants to do anything with them. And then the only thing that takes melons is this. Um, but it looks like it takes everything else. So there's zucchini, there's bell pepper, tomato, melons, cucumber, chilies. And then everything else is wild. What do I have that's not included in that? I don't think anything. I think everything except for the spicy pumpkin soup is included on this side, which is probably correct. All right, let's go put the rest of the stuff back. Milk, that, eggs, yes. Uh, pumpkins, yes. And then we're gonna keep the canned condensed milk. And then we're gonna sell 50 of those. Wait, I need the tomatoes. Oh crap, I almost used all my tomatoes. I did not even consider that, guys. Uh, tomato deliveries are gonna be down for a while. Okay, we'll do the spicy pumpkin soup missions. Ooh, I didn't even consider it. We'll leave those in there because Becky might need them for cooking. When it rains, she's going to want those. All right, let's go sell the condensed milk. And uh, we're going to buy a tractor today. We've got 104000 We're going to buy a tractor. It's not going to be the lender. It'll probably be the smaller of the, the custom, uh, custom tractors. That's okay, though. That's okay. We're going to buy a tractor. All right, last time, John. Good to see you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cut the small chatter. Here let's, to let's, trade. Go. Sure. let's go. Um, so I got 75 of those I need to sell. 719. And then I have uh, 75 of these I need to sell. I made 75 specifically for this. 719 more dollars. Okay, cool. Uh, what do you get for 1088 for those? I sell 100 of those for 1,000. I don't want to do that, though. Uh, $1.15 for the duck eggs. That's not bad. I mean, for the goose eggs. Not bad at all. All right, we have $105,000, finally. Uh, we also have 233,000 social points. So it is supposed to rain, not tomorrow, not the next day, but the day after. So two days from now, it's going to be raining. All right, let's go. Oh, mushrooms. Can't uh, not pick those up when you see them. Especially me right now. I need them. I just used all of mine. Mushrooms. I see one right here. I did. Pick up the mushroom. Mushroom. There it is. Thought I saw another one over here. Sweet. All right, so we picked up uh, five more mushrooms. Nice. I can't believe I had 113 mushrooms. I must have been saving those for a while. All right, back in the house. Let's go. Uh, let's go get rid of these. Put all this extra down here that we're not using. Uh, mushrooms. Yes. I think it automatically moved when I clicked on it. That was kind of weird, but okay, whatever. Let's go buy a tractor. Phew. We're going to buy the one uh, that is 91,000. It was 80,000. I know I'm like wasting 11,000. Oh my God, that field's ready too. Nice. I hope we get some cultivating missions now. Uh, I'm just happy to be buying a new tractor, to be quite honest. All right, let's head down here to this one. 
Just buy a new tractor with money I earned. Buy a new tractor. I don't know what rhymes with that. Uh, screenshot. Buy custom FV type tractor. Uh, what? Oh. I just barely clicked on it and it sold it to me. Okay. Uh, I still have $60,000. Let's go buy the plow. I thought this thing was 90000 I only had 104000 So. Oh, no. 142,000 social points. I really do not want to start this whole process over. But I did not double click on that to use my social points. Social points are hard to come by. And that's going to put me all the way back to the beginning of the day. And that would be over an hour of wasted time for me. But social points are so hard to come by, guys. Oh my god, what a mistake. Always save before you click on anything. I don't know why. I didn't click my mouse. I think I might have like clicked E, my keyboard double clicked, but I can't, I can't. That's, I mean, that, we're, we're talking like 140, we're talking a hundred and, uh, we're talking 90,000 social points is what that just cost me. Oh my God. I got to do all this over. Okay. Well, I'll be back. Well, I'm back. I skipped a couple extra days, hopefully hoping it would uh, increase the price of the canola. It did not. The canola actually went down, so now I'm getting less for it when I do go to sell it. Uh, the plus side is my little scarecrow guy over here is giving me double the apples, so I'm going to have tons of apples to make stuff with. Uh, I don't think that's what I ran out of on the last time I tried this, just a few minutes ago, 35 minutes ago to be exact, uh, but... <laughs> But uh, at least I'm getting double apples. I didn't even pay attention to that. So that's a positive, right, guys? We got to look for the positive things. Uh, so I'm trying to be positive about this whole not saving situation. Using my social points like a dummy. Uh, either way, um, again, thankful Miss Deuce understands me playing video games and making content and supports it. Otherwise, me sitting here for the last three hours is probably not acceptable. Uh, either way... I'm going to continue collecting apples uh, and get the grain run over to the store. And uh, I think you guys know the drill by now. I'll, I'll, I'll see you then. It's going to take me a little while. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. I'll be back in about an hour. Well, I skipped another day or two. So, my price went down for my crops. But as you can tell, I'm at the store. Uh also as the price went down on my crops i've only got back eighty thousand yet because i haven't sold all my crops and i haven't done all the greenhouse stuff but i did get two harvests out of the greenhouse i've been collecting honey as it goes well uh, but the price of this thing went down to seventy one thousand three hundred so i'm going to give it another little bit uh, a lot of these fields have crop on them now so i'm going to see there's a cultivate mission down here if some of these fields down here have crop on them i may take it doesn't look like they do though so i'm not going to take it we're going to let that one ride. We're going to go back to the house. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, the price is 675 right now. Uh, not not fantastic. Uh, but my fields are ready to harvest. And uh, looks like none of those have eggs because I haven't been picking them up. Uh, but my fields are ready for harvest. So that's good. That's more money because peas are still at... Um, 928, which is not fantastic. Uh, they were at like 1100 and something. But the greenhouse planted for the third time, and uh, they're just about ready to go again. So I'm going to keep hauling this over there, and then we'll go make up everything again, and I'll bring you back when I actually buy the tractors. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to wait again or what I'm going to do. I don't, I don't know how I'm going to do this, honestly. Uh, I think I may sleep another week, um, let the price drop some more on the grain, and hopefully it drops more on the tractor, because right now, uh, and I don't remember if Gargoyle said it was July or June. I was looking to see if I had a sticky note, uh, but it is June 
18th. I don't want the price to start going back up and me miss out on it. You know what I mean? Like, it would just be silly uh, to not go ahead and grab this thing when it's 71,000. Because just a short while ago, uh, it was 90, 98,000 or something. So maybe I need to go check and see what the other tractor's selling for right now and pick it up. Um, but I have totally, I have totally screwed all this up. So now I have a new save, so that's good. Uh, not gonna have to worry about that again. But yeah, I have, I have completely screwed myself on this whole deal here. Not what I was trying to do. Um, I just wanted to sell some stuff and buy a new tractor. That was my whole goal for the day. And now I've spent the last uh, three hours, uh, working on this because it takes forever to get back and forth to this grain. So yeah, that's where we stand. Uh, I got three more to deliver. I got two loads and then a half load, and then we'll go check prices. All right, I think I have everything back to back to where it was. Boy, I'm an idiot. Uh, that took a lot longer than I thought it was going to take. Uh, Becky was in the kitchen, so all the cooking and stuff we did, I had to redo. But she was in the kitchen for like two straight days, so I went fishing. I caught a bunch more fish, but I used all my bell peppers, so I didn't get to make uh, the entirety of the money we had. I got 105,000. I got a little more than what we had, I think. Uh, I'm still missing probably another three grand off of fish alone because um, I didn't cook anything with fish because I ran out of bell peppers. So I got to wait on that to do uh, over again. But I can buy this for 76000 Um This is the uh, custom CA type tractor. So buy and ride, baby. Woo! All right, our brand new tractor. I am so happy, so happy to be in this thing. I think it's 36 kilometers an hour. Uh, boy, look at the interior of this thing. Hand on the throttle and everything. Uh, so yeah, super happy to be in the new tractor. Uh, I don't think I've ever actually looked in the interior of this one. Uh, it's pretty basic, but everything seems to be here that, that's needed anyway. Uh, so we're going to head up to the store up north and pick up the brand new plow as well. So, uh, oh, man, it, it was hard for me to do this because I really wanted to buy the harvester because it's only 103000 right now. But I thought, you know what, if I can suffer for a little while longer, I can save up some more money, uh, do this again, and uh, get the new harvester and the grain header for it. Uh, as I don't I don't plan on doing maize right this second. I'll do maize after we get the new header uh, and the new harvester. Uh, but the new harvester would definitely be a big help because I wouldn't lose as much crop. So um, that's something I'm definitely going to have to look into, is getting the, the new harvester and header for it. But... For right now, oh boy, uh, we are going to head up to the store and buy ourselves a brand new plow. Tell them what they won. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm super excited so I don't have to use the, not the jack bear itself, but just the little plow anymore. Now I got the big plow, so uh, I don't, I won't mind doing some plowing missions from time to time at this point. Oh God, these, these heels, they're bumpy. Uh, also, a lot more fields are starting to grow in. It makes me happy. Uh, I just don't have the money to buy anything. I got 28000 The plow is 26000 so I got just enough money to do this. But on the upside, uh, as I do have more crops in the greenhouse, they're going to be ready before long. So let's take a trip through. These aren't sunflowers. There's something else. Uh, Sally pointed this out, I think, the other day. that They said it on stream back in December when they were streaming this around Christmas. Uh, there's, those are not sunflowers. They are something else, some other kind of flower uh, that is not native to where I live anyway. So... Uh, I can't remember exactly what they called it, but uh, not sunflowers. So there you go. Uh, but either way, we got our new tractor. I am so excited to have it. Uh, I know that a lot of people have been, there have been many, many comments uh, in the live streams and uh, in just comments in general. Man, why don't you buy a new tractor? Well, I didn't have the money to. Well, now I have the money and I got a new tractor. So I hope everybody is happier about it. Did I already check this chest? I think I did. Let's check it again to be sure, though. I did. Okay. Um, yeah, I hope everybody is happier now that I have the new tractor. We can get a lot more done. It's a lot faster. The next thing I want to look at is the big grain trailer and how much it costs. So, um, I, I would much rather just go ahead and get the plow, though, and get this over with. Because uh, I don't want to have to... Oh, this thing's in here at a weird angle, isn't it? It is. Yeah, it's almost facing this way. It's kind of strange. I want to go ahead and get backed up to this thing like I'm about to purchase it because I'm not backing out and going to buy the grain trailer as bad as I want to. 
Uh, the grain trailer would be a huge help, but this plow right here is going to save us a ton of time doing these plowing missions. And it's something that I need to do. So 26,269.50. Bye. We have $2,000 again. It's like we're starting all over once again. But you know what? Oh, you can move stuff around at the store. I didn't even realize that. I think I'm pretty sure. Well, maybe I didn't move the cultivator. But boy, look at that sucker right there. Heck yeah, I am I'm ecstatic. This is this is fantastic. Uh, plowing is going to take a lot less time now. Oh boy. Oh, how much are greenhouses right now? I didn't even think to check the price of those. They're only 121,000 right now. Last time I checked, they were 144,000. So yeah, right now is definitely the time to buy things. And this might be, I might be buying too early. I might get everything cheaper. Um, but I did save separately right before I bought this. So if I can get everything cheaper, I'm going to go back to the save. Um, what I plan on doing is going to skip it a month and we're going to check this out real quick. Check, test this theory. Uh, that you can get stuff cheaper if you buy it between July 15th and 20th instead of June 15th and 20th. And I'm not real sure that's the case. I think it might be June, but I don't remember exactly what Gargoyle told me. So we're going to try it out, though, for you guys. That way you guys know. You'll have the meta on this. And I don't think the consoles are going to have this feature yet. I think everything for you is probably the same price right now as far as equipment goes. Uh, crops are probably slightly different, but everything else should be the same price, I think. So let's get back to the house here and uh yeah i'm gonna save this on a different save but i want to compare the size of this thing it's been so long since i've had the jack bear plow and this one at the same time uh that i don't remember what they look like exactly together so uh we are going to sell that plow though i, d I don't want to keep this thing i have no need for it really all right let's flip it back over this way We'll get an actual comparison here. The hitbox on that thing's huge. Holy crap. Yeah, here's an actual comparison. So. Yeah, there's an actual comparison of the size difference. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's a pretty good size difference. Yeah, I'm happy with that purchase. Uh, $103,000 gone, but uh, the upside to that is we now have ourselves a brand new plow and a brand new Fent tractor that's about to be orange as well as a plow is about to be orange. If I can get it in there anyway. I think I can. I think if I'm back in there at an angle, we should be okay, right? Oh, there we go. Enter fuel tank. All right. Uh, I'm trying to remember where I did these. I think the green was like right here somewhere and the blue is all the way off. Was the red wide open? Yeah, I think the red was like wide open and the green was like right next to the E there. I think that's it. I, that's pretty close if nothing else. Uh, the tractor's going to go the same color. So It came full of fuel though, so that's always good. Alright, let's get this sucker repainted. Repaint, red wide open, green right over that E, and then blue all the way off. Done repainting. Oh, look at that bad boy. That looks so good. That looks like a new tractor. I am super, super happy about that. Uh, now I won't dread plowing so much. Let's uh, let's set this thing down right here out the way. Oh, God. It puts you inside the camera still. A few little bugs still, still floating around there. All right, let's take the little plow now. Wait, can I not attach? Okay, I was about to say, I would have been upset if I'd have had money just for this tractor and not for the plow. And I couldn't, uh, I couldn't hook to this plow. You guys have no idea how mad I'd have been about that. It doesn't pick up as high as the other one, does it? Let's run this puppy over to the store here and sell it. Because we don't need it no more. I mean, think about the comparison of this, seriously. Like, I was, I was literally about to just jump to the store. And then I started looking at this and I was thinking to myself, that red plow is too big for this tractor, and this little one right here is way too small for the tractor. So, think about the the comparison there on the color. This the, the color. I'm looking at the color difference. It's driving me nuts. 
uh, but the the size difference of this it's amazing how different this is like it, it is crazy how different it is um, the sizes in those anyway to the store alrighty got her dropped off we're gonna leave it here sell plow for twenty one hundred dollars we have ourselves four thousand dollars how much is that thing thirty two how much is one of these it holds eleven thousand. The one we got now holds five thousand, I think. So sixteen thousand. That's not bad. I kind of want to run down. How much was this one? This tractor? Seventy-one thousand. Okay. And then the lender was eighty-four. Um, I'll kind of want to run down to the other uh, the other store just to check and see. But I think I might uh, hit the bus stop and go from here. I think it'd be faster. The big red one, I think, is down at the store down here, maybe? Yeah, I think that's right. See where it lands. Which way we're going to be facing? Never know. Aha. The big red one is not down here. I thought it was. Oh, no, the flagel is the one I want. Yeah, not not the red one. The flagel. How much is that bad boy? 17000 That's not bad either. Dang. That one's 112 right now. It was 144. No, 160. I've got it written down. Uh, 164,000. Last time I looked. No, 144,000. Sorry. The 164,000 was for crops on uh, Farm Sim 19. Multiplayer server. Um, I'm going to go to this bus stop and go one more place real quick. Let's go up to this store. Because I'm pretty sure this is the one that's got the red one. It's not a Flygel. What is it? Uh... Crampy, the Crampy trailer. It's only fifteen thousand, but it only holds sixteen thousand kilograms. Wait a minute, it's the same as the. This holds the same as the uh, the Flagel trailer. New bale trailer gonna cost us. It's pretty expensive. But the new baler, thirty grand. Holy crap! But the lawnmower, seven thousand. Okay. And then these guys hold what? Eleven k, and they're sixteen thousand. Yeah, there's no reason to buy those. And this is not any bigger than our uh, current Harrow that we have, so we're definitely not buying one of those. All right, let's go back to our brand new tractor. Sweet. Off we go in the brand. Oh God, we done we done we done messed up right right away with the brand new tractor. Brand new baby, brand new. All right. Well, I am pretty happy about the progress today. I would have been done uh, real time about two and a half hours ago had I not. Uh, accidentally bought the other tractor with social points because I'm a dummy. Um, but uh, I got it all sorted, got back to where I wanted to be. We got more crops in the greenhouse growing, so we're, we're good. We're in good shape. We got uh, $4,100 of operating money, which is always nice to have. You got to have some operating money. There's still a floating tree in this. And I think my file's corrupt or something. I don't know what's going on. Uh, either way, that's going to do it for this video, guys. If you did enjoy, remember to leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you thought. Uh, you can catch me over on Twitch a little bit later today, uh, here in a couple hours. Keep a, keep a look out for the notification. If you don't follow me on Twitch, go do so, or you can find me at dosms.tv. If you want to find me on Twitch directly, you can head on over to twitch.tv slash dosms. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe here if you're not subscribed already, and if you're subscribed and you haven't hit that notification bell, do so. It helps the channel analytics out a lot. Also, uh, I forgot I could do that. Also, it, uh... It'll help you get notified sometimes, um, maybe, uh, of when I post videos or go live here. So be sure to follow, subscribe, like, uh, whatever you want to do there. Uh, you can find all my social media links down below. Or, like I said, the easiest way to find everything for the outhouse and for me is at dosms.tv. It's dosms.tv. Head on over there and you can find all the links for everything today. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. Later, everybody.